Here are a few animals who may just be smarter than a fifth grader. Number 9. Octopus Okay, maybe this doesn't come as a surprise to a few of us. We already know that octopus aren't stupid. Remember that one time when an octopus basically made a prison break out of a New Zealand aquarium and went back to the ocean? Yes, an octopus was smart enough to figure that out. They're definitely not a lifeless blob floating around the ocean like a jellyfish or something. It's not even close. An octopus is both a skilled hunter and a crafty evader of predators at the same time. Evolution has gifted them the ability to be nature's most impressive shapeshifters. They're able to change colors to blend in with their environments. However, their most important feature has to be their big brains. They have neurons on their tentacles, allowing each tentacle to sense and think on its own. They actually have more neurons in their tentacles than in their brain. The octopus might as well be an alien from outer space because of how smart they are. Research suggests that an octopus might actually be capable of conscious thought. Because they can't see their own skin color change, they employ an inner dialogue of sorts to determine when and what color to change their skin. They do this even when there's no other creature present to observe them. Number 8. Crows if science has proven that you can recognize faces and use tools, then we're gonna go ahead and say you're smarter than you look. The things that crows do are fascinating. Crows have been studied where they were found to drop nuts on the road, let cars run over the nuts to crack them, and then scoop the nuts up to eat them. Brilliant! Okay, so they're smart, but just how smart? One 2014 biology study showed that they can work problems out spontaneously. So, what's going on? Crows tend to have bigger brains when compared to their body size. In mammals, the bigger-brained animals are us and dolphins. In birds, it's parrots and crows. Crows can also make plans. How? Well, plenty of animals store food. But crows take it to another level. When crows have food they want to store, they make sure no other crow is watching. If there's another crow around, they'll just pretend to hide their food and stuff the food into the feathers on their chest. However, since all crows do this, they'll just follow each other, which leads to a fight. Crows have also been seen using blades of grass as knives, which in turn allows them to make other tools. They're also known to understand complex principles such as displacement and gravity. By many estimates, they're as smart as the average 5 to 7 year old. Not quite a 5th grader, but still not bad. Number 7. Sea Lion You might not know it by looking at them, but sea lions are quite smart. In fact, scientists study their brain to learn more about human brains. Now that's saying something. Sea lions are found in oceans all over the world, and on average can live between 20 to 30 years. Research has shown they're known to use logic. Think about that for a moment. Most animals rely on their evolutionary instincts to survive. But sea lions are known to apply logic. They're the only animal known to reason with logic. A group of scientists at Vanderbilt University analyzed a sea lion's brain. The team discovered that their brains have a large section that corresponds to their whiskers. Sea lions use their whiskers to detect food and sensations, similar to how we use our fingers. Our brains allot a similar amount of space to react to these senses as well. Researchers mapped a sea lion's brain in order to get a better understanding of how they may be similar to us and how our own brains evolved to be so big. Sea lion brains are about the same size as chimpanzee brains. Although they have some features in common with the brains of their closest relatives, which are dogs, cats, bears, and weasels, their brains are also intensely folded in a fashion similar to that of whales and dolphins. Number 6. Tuskfish Meet the tuskfish. You'll find them around Australia's Great Barrier Reef. Now, unless marine biology happens to be your hobby, or you watch a lot of Animal Planet, you've probably never heard of a tuskfish. And if you haven't, you're missing out. Why? That's because the tuskfish has membership to a very exclusive club. They're one of the few members of the animal kingdom to use tools. Obviously, they're not out here using hammer and nails, but they use what nature has gifted them to their advantage. For instance, tuskfish love eating clams. Clams are their favorite. Clams love hiding in the sand because they understandably don't want to be eaten by a tuskfish or anything else. 
So, to bring the clams out of hiding, the tuskfish will flap its gills to create enough force to blow the sand off the clams. But they're not finished yet. They still need to get to the meat on the inside. So, these guys will take the clam into their mouths, and with surgical-like precision, they'll quickly smash the clam against some coral. Now that's ingenuity. Sharks have their sharp teeth and speed, whereas a tuskfish has their mind and some coral. Different strokes for different fish. Number 5. Prairie Dogs Here's a surprise. Prairie dogs are kinda smart. Researcher Khan Slobodjikov has been studying prairie dogs for over 30 years. One thing he's learned is that they have these alarm calls. That part seems pretty normal. But another thing he found was that their alarm calls slightly differ based on the perceived threat. So, for example, they'll make one call for humans and another one for coyotes. He even found that their calls vary from one coyote to the next, or one human to the next. He believes the reason is because they can actually describe physical features of the perceived predator. While he's yet to translate these calls, it's a fascinating discovery in and of itself. What's even more interesting is that the language of prairie dogs isn't even all the same. It's unlikely that different species of prairie dogs would be unable to understand the calls of each other. It makes sense that prairie dogs have developed such a sophisticated communication system. Living in large groups known as towns, they often have to cooperate in large groups to survive. These towns can consist of thousands of members, and it's critical that every member of the community is on the lookout for danger. Number 4. Goats Goats? Goats are smart? They may not seem smart to most of us, but they are. A 2014 article published in Frontiers in Zoology outlined just how smart goats truly are. Researchers found that goats excel at learning and remembering a highly novel cognitive task. Well, that's literally the title of their published paper. The reasons for this, they argue, are rooted in complex social dynamics, such as maintaining group cohesion. They develop their learning abilities early on in life. Goats live together and, therefore, must learn how to cooperate in order to survive. The article also points out that their memory develops at an early stage as a means to solve problems. For instance, they have to remember areas to forage as resources become scarce for them. To test out their theory, the researchers set up a series of tests to measure the goat's social and physical cognition, as well as their memory. Long story short, they passed with flying colors. Basically, they studied to see how well goats learned by themselves, and how well they learned by studying other goats. The researchers concluded that goats in general learn on their own very well, and don't need to study other goats. Of the dozen goats involved in the study, nine of them successfully learned highly challenging tasks. They repeatedly tested the goats again several weeks past. The goats were able to complete the tasks without needing to relearn the tasks, showing excellent memory. Number 3. Dolphins By now, many people are aware of dolphin intelligence. They can do so many smart things, it's kinda crazy. Take the dolphins at Roatan Institute for Marine Science, or RIMS, for example. At this research center and resort, they've been trained to skate backwards across the water while standing on their tails, and wave their pectoral fins at the tourists who arrive on the cruise ships. Researchers are trying to understand how dolphins think as well. For example, researchers at RIMS observed two of their dolphins whistling at each other underwater. Technically, no one knows what they're actually doing. But the working theory is that they're communicating some sort of a plan, as they often mimic each other in these instances. Since dolphins have a brain mass similar to that of humans, most experts seriously doubt they'd waste all that time and energy for something as frivolous as whistling just for fun. Pound for pound, relative to body size, dolphins have brains that are still among the largest in the animal kingdom. Brains larger than those of chimpanzees. In a nutshell, researchers are still trying to find a pattern between their vocalizations and behavior. But even absent of a language unique to them, dolphins are still incredibly smart mammals. They're known to teach, learn, make plans, cooperate in large groups, and even grieve. Skeptics argue that dolphins might not be all that smart, and all this supposedly complex behavior is open to human interpretation. Number 2. Turtles Growing up, we've all heard the story about the tortoise and the hare. 
It's a cautionary tale, where the hare banks on his speed to guarantee him the victory, but we all know that the tortoise uses his wit and determination to win the race. So why did we bring that up? It's because turtles aren't just good at being steady in a race, they're also good at being steady in a maze. A recent article on animal cognition advances the theory that turtles can master mazes. Slowly, but smartly. This idea was based on some pretty interesting research led by Dr. Anna Wilkerson from Lincoln University. She set up a series of mazes complete with strawberry treats with the goal of testing out spatial cognition in reptiles. Dr. Wilkerson wanted to see if a red-footed female tortoise named Moses could solve the maze without revisiting sections of the maze she had been to. So she put some of those strawberry treats in eight different arms of the maze. Moses was tasked with finding and eating each treat without going back to a section she had previously visited. The results? Moses did well. Really well, in fact. After a series of tests, Dr. Wilkerson concluded that Moses possessed an impressive amount of spatial cognition. Additional tests by Dr. Wilkerson also revealed that turtles have shown signs of social learning. Considering they live mostly solitary lives, that was a surprising development. It also challenges long-held stereotypes about reptiles, who generally aren't thought of as smart creatures. Number 1. Chimpanzee Smart as a chimp isn't a term, but perhaps it should be. While chimps are generally known for just being relatively smart, they're actually highly intelligent creatures. The first non-human to learn sign language was, you guessed it, a chimp. A chimp's intelligence is based partially on genes, similar to humans. One study determined that genes determine about half the variability in a chimp's intelligence, while environmental factors account for the other half. While chimpanzees might not have mastered the same superior language skills as we have, new research suggests that, in at least some respects, they may be our intellectual equals, and maybe even our superiors. Researchers pitted chimpanzee mothers against their babies in a basic computer game that tested their ability to strategize by learning from past moves. The game wasn't explained to the chimps, but they figured it out quickly. One chimp would choose a left or right button. The other chimp would try to guess which button would be played. For each round, just one of the players would win a prize of apple pieces. The researchers pitted humans against each other in the exact same game, although the payoff was financial instead. Again, the game wasn't explained, and the players weren't allowed to talk with each other. Researchers found that the chimps played at a much faster pace than the humans, and the chimpanzees' games reached equilibrium state, as predicted by game theory, much faster than the humans. Essentially, the chimps figured out the game's nuances more quickly than the humans did. Here's what's next. 